Coalition to End Homelessness is evaluating services after the road home closed just last month. This amid resource centers being blamed for not having enough beds for people living on the streets. ABC4's Jared Jotnini has the story. Well, the coalition met here at the multi-agency building for a routine meeting, but before any new information was shared, the coalition took time to clear the air about bed availability. It was a packed house. The state measured November 22nd to December 5th. The numbers show all three resource centers were at a 94% capacity. Despite that, the coalition says no one is ever turned away. There are other options such as Wagand, St. Vincent's, a warming center, or a partnering provider saying it's a process to get someone in need a bed and it takes patience from the client. Moving forward, the coalition says overcoming gaps in the system starts with better communication with outreach providers and folks dealing with homelessness. We wanted to ensure that regardless of where they were accessing the system, that as a community and as partners within as partners here at the table, we could really start to work together and have this open dialogue and conversations in terms of the needs. One way folks dealing with homelessness can get help is by calling this 24 hour number you see there on your screen. Last month, the state says that number was called 800 times. The coalition wants to stress this is a transition period, understands resources are needed and is working to help folks as best it can. In Salt Lake, Jared Jotsonini, ABC 4 News.